Hello, this is Maker J101, and probably about after five hours of five plus hours of running, my Sterling engine seems to be doing quite well. But the displacer, I think it's falling apart because it makes noise when it's going up and down. So I'm gonna take it apart here. But you can see that I um, uh, burned a candle underneath of it and got it all good and black, so I could um, with the soot so that it would absorb more sunlight because I was running on my um, Fresno lens and I wanted it to absorb all the sun so I just coated it with some I just took a candle and burned it underneath of it and got it real good and carbonized so I'm just going to take it apart here show how quick it is to take apart I guess well yeah I'm using my drill that I made speed up the process a little bit Yeah, so you just take out the eight screws on top, and it, that's how you take it apart. And they're all out now. Now, just pull it apart. Yeah, it is falling apart. See, the JB weld is all... like... gone. It's like... turned into a powder. Must not be enough temperature for this so this part right here is hitting the bottom I guess it's good I left these little wires on to hold it together so I guess I got it a little bit too hot it's all this goop down here yuck but this can is holding up fairly well there's some rust in there from the um, displacer. Some icky bits. But that's holding up. Yeah, but that's the problem right there. So I might redo the JB weld on there. But I think I'm just gonna um, build a new Sterling engine. Put this one in the scrap bin. Because I don't, I, I can't really, I don't think I can really improve this one much more. Because I the air cooling doesn't work that well, and I think I want to upgrade to water cooling instead, because it'll run more efficiently and I'll get more power out of it. So yeah, so I guess this one's just gonna not be used much anymore. I'll probably put it back together so it's in working order, but I'll just not use it much. But I still have the remains of a project I was working on laying around. I took apart a um, flat screen LCD TV. The screen was cracked. That's what the problem was with it. I found along the road. But yeah, this is the screen here. It's pretty bad. But it still worked. It was just that there was a big crack in the screen. So it's pretty much trash. But yeah, there's still bits strewn everywhere. Here, this part here is the is a big fluorescent tube array and the driver board is down there but this thing it it requires um you have to hook this one wire up when you to make it turn on but you just hook up um 24 volts here and then um hook this up to a voltage and it lights up but it the thing is it draws about six point six and a half amps of power so it's like 150 watts, it's really bright. But on this side, yeah, but it's really nice. It's kind of cool. Yeah, but that's what I've been working on lately. The circuit boards are over here. But yeah, 
So my Sterling engine, I think I'll retire this one. Thanks for watching.